Hi, I'm Matt, a data engineer turned DevRel, and today I'm here to talk about fast HTML, a promising new framework that lets you build entire web apps using only Python. Now, building web apps in Python isn't new, but most of the other tooling has a limited DevX and doesn't allow the same flexibility as JavaScript front-end frameworks. After playing with fast HTML, I'm here to say that a lot of that functionality is surprisingly covered in a very early release of the package. So what is fast HTML? It's a new framework that's built on fast API and HTMX, and it allows you to define apps and components using a Pythonic familiar interface. In fast HTML, classes define HTML components with the attributes of those classes fitting nicely into different attributes of the HTML. It brings FastAPI's similar route-based interface, but also takes heavy inspiration from JavaScript front-end frameworks like React. It's super simple to use. It's just a pip install Python fast HTML. And out of the box, you can run the routes with a Python main.py. I use it to build and deploy my own guestbook, an app that allows any user to write a message on my blog. It has a clean CSS UI and responsive desktop and mobile interface, something that I was able to spin up by prompting Claude in only a few hours. FastHTML is based on FastAPI and makes use of HTMX for custom dynamic components. You can also inject JavaScript into your app to really dial in custom functionality. So let's talk about my demo. Using FastHTML, I built a guestbook for my blog. It logs data in a Replit key value database, something that was really easy because it only took a few lines to set up. That key value database allows the guestbook to persist across sessions, so nothing gets deleted if you refresh your browser or if you log on as a different user. The code is really simple and straightforward. It's about 150 lines of Python, even with all the comments and documentation. There's a main route that returns the homepage, but also routes for updating and creating the content that lives inside the application. One route gets refreshed on click, and that's just powered through some HTMX. The other route gets refreshed about every 10 seconds. Once you get used to the syntax, it's actually quite easy to read and understand. The code is available on GitHub for you to tinker with and try out, and I've included versions that run both locally and on Replit. To get started, check out the links in the description or head over to docs.fasht.ml to read the documentation. This is a really new project, so it might take a bit of tinkering and there are still some interesting nuances uh, and functionality the team's working on, but I've also found the Discord community to be really active and helpful. Again, I'm Matt, and this has been an overview of the fast HTML framework, as well as a demo of an application I built in only a few hours. Until next time, peace.